great moment. Oh, we got another time trap. I don't do three at once, what? I have to come back to this one. Yes, with Susie! Ah, open, you stupid door! <laughs> ah, great. It's you guys. <laughs> Susie! You were ever so worried about me. Uh, how did you get past those spikes before? Won't you? But uh, this door sucks. Aw, don't you worry, Susie. I'll open it after we solve the puzzle over there. Nice. Tell me when you finish it. Uh, Susie, we need you to finish it. Sometimes proceeding will take all three of us. Furthermore, only Chris can seal the dark fountain. Hope you don't accompany us. We won't make it home. You're saying I have to stay with you, guys? Yep. Ugh. Let's just get this over with. Yahoo! Susie's back on the team. Cue the fanfare. Susie joined the party. That was very um. Susie follows at a distance such that no one can tell she's associated. <laughs> Let's try this again, shall we? One, and two, and... Uh, I need to do this in particular order, don't I? One, two, three. It sounded like the door opened. Let's go and see if it was the door. Uh, what is that? Uh, Chris, I just realized Susie missed the tutorial. Next battle, we should show how to act. I think she might really enjoy that. What is that thing? The sea round attacked violently. Okay. You recall Release's advice to include Susie in an act. Okay, act. Sea round. Compare. Uh, you can defend. You ordered Susie to flatter the enemy. What? Why the hell would I do that? It attacked us! Let's smash it before it moves! Oh, look, Susie! It seems harmless. If you act nice, we might win without hurting it. Okay, okay. Hey, little guy! I really like the axe in your face! Wow. <laughs> Where'd you get <laughs> Um, Chris? Maybe I should talk to her. You won. You got zero XP and fifteen dollars. <sighs> I sneak. I made a sign. Cyclops. Lance is becoming a bit of an annoyance. Why can't I go through the door? Uh. Oh. Susie, I, I suppose you missed what I said earlier. As heroes, we have the power to make a peaceful future. So from now on, let's try to avoid fighting, okay? Um, what if you just took it easy on me? If you weaken an enemy, I can use my pacify spell, which can put exhausted people to sleep. Mm. Yeah. You talk, he goes already doing that. <sighs> well, um, just think about it. You might have to warn enemies about her, Chris. I want to know what this thing is. I also want to say, Susie, the violent tormentor, is now your ally. The power of mean girls shines within you. Hey, seems shot. I'm guessing this is seam over here. Hey, hey, kid. You wanna buy a tutorial? It's 
only 50 dark dollars. Um, no. <laughs> Did I say 50? It just went out of sale. 20, 20 dark dollars. Uh, no. One, only one dollar. Please, please, please. I need this right now. Do we give him one dollar? Look at that face. Look at the face he's making. Should we give it to him? What do you think, guys? Do it. We'll buy a tutorial. Really? Change my mind? Look, it's Susie to cover him. <laughs> right, this way, gentlemen. Gentlemen's? What is this? Whole goals. <clears throat> One dollar monthly tutorial, weekly, weekly tutorial, monthly. What? One dollar monthly tutorial, weekly, or weekly tutorial, monthly. Stop making tutorials. What? We're sorry. We're normally puzzle guys, but we've been forced to do tutorials just to make ends meet. When the king got power, he fired everyone and replaced all the puzzle makers with him. Ruxel's card, Lord of the Puzzles, be careful. I'm a releasey master. Tell me about the releases. Um, pacify. Releasey spells called pacify. Use it on babies before they cry. What? It safely removes a tired enemy from combat. What if you're fighting a baby? These guys are going to give me all unhelpful advice, aren't they? I'm a TP master to ask me about TP. What's TP? TP? What's TP? That's what let you cast spells, you see? When you see at the orange bar, cast some spells when it's filled up bar. TP, it's quite a caper. TP stands for toilet paper. <sighs> no, it stands for tension points. What? Really? Oh, jeez. Secret. TP only lasts inside a fight. Once you win, it's out of sight. Having extra feels unbearable. No point in saving. Straight up terrible. But leftover TP turns into extra money at the end of battle. You mean I should only be using one square? Wow. Uh, uh, bye. Later, kid. Sorry, this guy. What was the other option? Uh, give me a, give me a fact. Releases love it when you give us money. He will hug you and call you money. Hey, that's not true. You don't need money to get me to do that. Aww. I'm a Susie master. Just tell me about Susie's. Warning. When Chris uses warning, Susie can't hit. So make sure to... So there's no reason to use it. Unless, unless you want it not to hurt. So there's no reason. <laughs> um, should we get a fact? Susie loves when you give us money. She mm -hmm. will... Nope. Don't care. Did I say something funny? <laughs> uh, attack. Susie's always aura is attack. The foe on top. She'll smash them with a crushing chop. She always strikes at the first thing she sees. Oh no! Oh no! She's looking at me! <laughs> I'm a Chris master. Ask me about Chris's. Reviving. When HP goes into negative, your friends fall down. But bringing them back is an easy town. Plain foods and spells work like a charm. And with a mint, you can cure all harm. Even normal items and spells can revive people, huh? Yep, that's what I'm saying. Okay, that's handy though. Fact. It's a good idea to give us bucks. It'll make you happy and fill us fill you with lux. Over there is our donation hall. We had a box, but it got stolen. Jeez. Acting. If you only act, you might start to think, what about the guy with the scarf in pink? If you know acting if you know acting will make the enemy friendly then you can ask me to spare on the same turn. Or you can cast Pacify if you know there'll be time. If you plan ahead, a lot can happen in one turn. Hey, who's the master here? Me or you? Okay, donation hall. If 
if you like our tutorials, please throw money into the hole. We'll give them one buck. You put a dollar in the hole, the hole became full. Um, the hole is filled to the brim with cash. The king didn't even give us a severance pay. The son just gave us all beanies. Itchy beanies. They're the worst, aren't they, right? They're the worst, guys. You ever got, you got one of those itchy beanies? I had a really nice itchy beanie. It was a really nice beanie, but then I started wearing it and realized how itchy it was. I just went. Ooh! Hello, you're a cat! Hey, <laughs> welcome, traps. Um, talk? Don't have anything better to do? Talk about yourself. The name's Seam, pronounced Sean. And this is my little shop. Shop. Over the years, I've collected odds and ends, because I've no attachment to any of it. It's just a hobby of mine. Around here, you learn to find ways to pass the time, or go mad like everybody else. Um, like this? Long ago, the darkness filled in harmony with the lighterness. Lived in harmony, so lived. They were like gods to us. Our predictors, our creators, those who gave us purpose. Then one day we were all locked away in this prison, and the lightness never returned. Bitter was the king, and aims to take of revenge upon the lightness that left us behind. Of course, even among his troops, some still distantly hope the lightness will return. Historically, this land was ruled by four kings from the Card Castle to the east. Oh, we called it! I'm guessing the Card Castle is, in fact, the four different card symbols that we were talking about earlier. But recently, a strange knight appeared, and three of the kings were locked away. The remaining king put him and his strange son in power. This land hasn't seen this much chaos since. <laughs> well, you don't need to know about it. We're legendary. <laughs> so you're the heroes. We're going to seal the fountain. Ah, good luck. It makes no difference to me. Neither light nor dark hold my future or darkness in my condition. Okay. Let's exit. Let's see what it's I can buy some candy. I can buy a burger. A mysterious hamburger that heals 7 HP. I can buy an amber card, which increases everybody's defense except for mine. Or I can buy a weapon. Spooky sword. Um, let's see how much I can sell a dark candy for. I can sell a dark candy. Thanks for that. Um, now I have enough to buy a spooky sword. Glow shot for a thousand, for a hundred, which is pretty good. But I have no idea what it does yet. It might actually do nothing. Uh, that'll do for now, I guess. See you again. Or not. <laughs> okay, let's equip the new items. Spooky sword, please. Spookiness up. A black and orange sword with a bat hilt. That's pretty cool. Susie with a hammer card. A thin square charm that sticks to you, increasing your defense. Cool. Um, I can sell my wood blade though. I don't need that anymore. Sell, sell weapon, wood blade. Yes. Some money. Let's save it again. Ooh. 
Ooh, spooky door. We go right past the spooky. <laughs> Lancer. Well, flip my flapjacks. The clowns are back in town. Well, bad news. Since you last saw me several minutes ago, I've created a brand new fighting team ready to stop you. Not even the purple girl can stop me now. Oh, are you ready to be? Stop. Stop. Ho, oh, ho, ho. What is that? Why are you even saying that? Ho, oh, ho, ho. That's why you laugh. Scary, right? You sound like a baby Santa Claus. Uh, you mean, like, in a badass way? Shut up. <laughs> I really like Susie. You really think you know how to be scary? What? Well, I... Wrong. Man, I want a tough guys like you really piss me off. Face it. You wouldn't know scary if he picked you up and bit your face off. That's... that's not true. Oh, really? Then why don't we prove it? We'll start with the part where your face gets bit off. <laughs> oh, okay, I get it. Thank you, purple girl. What? Thanks, yeah, it was kind of you. To teach me how to be scary with an evil laugh. Hey, I wasn't. And now? You're gonna be thrashed. <laughs> Merry Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's kind of an improvement. Oh joy. A board of jigsawaries blocks the way. Okay, let's act on the top one and we'll warn it. We'll warn it. You and Release warn the enemies about Susie. Everyone went on guard. Missed. Fighting! I love fighting! Oh. Oh, 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 that was good. Jigsawry thought of its boss and felt afraid. All right, okay. Um, we will attempt to be friends. Um, and then we can spare it, I guess. We barely lifted a finger and... All right, you win, let's be friends. This is bad, Jigsawary. I always have to be a friend like you. We're all friends now, la la. Jigsawary is trying to calculate this month's ring. Wow. Um, okay, let's spare the two of them. Chris spared the Jigsawary. Pretty easy spared the Jigsawary. You won, you got zero XP and 65 dark dollars. Should I go back through and see what the spooky door was? It's a lone door frame, but for some reason you can't see through it. Oh, it's just a door frame, it's not actually a door. Okay. Oh, look Chris, another puzzle. Oh, no. Let's read the instructions. Uh, huh. Instructions have vandalized. It says, Thoust fools, thou will never figure it out now. Burning instructions, that's definitely against the rules. Then it um says, yes, I make my own rules. Okay. Well, that explains that. Why don't we just climb over this spike fence? Um, because then we get impaled and die? Cool. I'll work on that. And you can do the puzzle. Um, tell your best, Chris. Oh, these blocks. Can I move these blocks? I can. Great job, Chris. 
I think you're onto something. Hey, Chris. Give up whenever you feel like it. It's all good. No, I got this. There we go. Whoa, you did it, Chris. Great job. Damn. Didn't get to impale myself. Oh, well. Come on, chumps. Good job, Chris. Ah, uh, there's a bad guy over there. Can we try and dodge him? We tried. And failed. Um, act. Let's try the top dude. Oh, we need to warn him, don't we? Warn him. You and Releasey warned enemies about Susie. Everybody went on guard. I'm just a normal person. I'm just a normal person. Cut these bloody beats audible. Um, let's do the happy then. We'll flatter them all. The order of release to flatter all the enemies. Out of anyone, I'm glad we randomly encountered all of you. Shine, shine. Ugh. Ugh. Kathy is whispering a lovely spell. Okay, we can spell. We can spell them all now. Okay. Chris spared a rudin. Release is better hand. Long live the guy who pays us. Ooh, Some loyalty right there. Rudin thinks about elaborate stones. When you step into the light, you'll return to where you were before. Okay, so don't step into the light then. And then immediately steps into the light. Is this just a simple pattern going down? Should I go back and see what was at the top first? Oh no, that guy's respawned. Let's just carry on this way. Okay. Now. How do I get to the end there? No! Okay, so you need to start at the top and be at the bottom by the time it comes along. There we go. And... Oh! What? 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 Pondman drawn here. What is a Pondman? Oh, we get lullaby? I just realised I made a fatal mistake there. I didn't warn them about Susie attacking. Oh! Everyone fell asleep. Pondman can't keep his eye open. We can spare that one, and then we can pacify. Oh no, we can't. No, the other. I don't think pacify is going to work, is it? Because it's not. Um, it's not fully yellow. It's only slightly yellow. Maybe. I don't think it'll work. Okay, let's act on this one. Give it a warning. Common can't keep his eye open. Okay, so let's try let's try doing it now. So we'll spare the top one. And then we'll magic pacify the bottom one. 
the spare component. Greasy carpets. Yay! Okay, we're gonna blitz through here just in case any of these other ones try and spawn. Start the top and work down again. That was bad. Interesting. How do I get to the end here? I was sprinting. Um, let's try again. Nope. Nope. I'm nowhere near the end there. Oh, zigzag. Ah, I got it. That was tricky. <laughs> so you've begun to cross the Great Fork. The halfway point to our castle. Hmm, impressive. So it's a shame. You won't make it a step further. Because my guys are about to smash you into blood. Lots of blood, splooshing blood. Very gross and bad. Is that a bucket? Hey, Bubble Girls! That's scary. Why are you asking me? Because you're really cool at being terrified. I want to be as scary as you. You want to be like me? Yeah! Well... Stupid. But, um, the new laugh isn't as all. And saying you turn us into blood is, uh, cool. What the hell is up with the bucket, though? It's to put the blood in. Oh. Yeah, I'm not, uh, I'm supposed to make a mess. Anyway, thanks for your feedback. I'm really feeling scary. Um, no problem. I guess. <laughs> so are you guys gonna attack us or... Uh... Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I was so excited, I forgot to bring uh, any guys. But next time, it'll be the end, of course. Hey, I've just been calling you guys clowns. Does your team have an official name or something? Oh, Chris. We should come up with a name. No, we shouldn't. And it's decided. Everyone puts a name in the bucket. All right, everyone, put their name into the entries. New person, you can choose. Since you look like you don't care. <laughs> Lancer labeled paper, neat paper, or crumpled paper. I'm gonna take a sip of drink, guys. What do you reckon? Make it Lance's one, just for the laugh. You take the paper with Lance written on the outside. You open it up. On the inside, it also says Lance. Wow. Who did that one? It's really good. Why do you get to choose the name? Hey, he did. Chris did. Yeah. It doesn't matter who may have written on it. Regardless, Lance is gonna be the going to be absolute doom. His name feels weird. I know. Let's call it Lance's fan club for short. See you later. Be right back making coffee quick. The power of the Lancer fan club shines within you.